video camera on so you guys can see me. Uh, just for those that are that are uh, uh, weak at heart or, or uh, I don't want to scare any kids, uh, but I'm going to turn it on and introduce myself, and then I promise I'll uh, turn it right back off. There we go, guys. Um, again, thank you for attending. And uh, I'm going to be assisted today by uh, our marketing team in San Angelo. And so I'm going to let them introduce themselves also. There's Miss Jessica Perkle and Matt hey Green, who is part of her team. Hello. So uh, they will be assisting me today and helping me uh, keep track of any questions you may have and uh, keeping me on track and, uh, and uh, not veering off course too far. So there, I uh, got the video out of the way. So guys, the, uh, the Tap Out is our latest version of our stick product. About three years ago, we introduced the Quick Stick, which was uh, uh, sort of the first affordable um, T12 replacement product on the market. And our Quick Sticks really took off. And, uh, and then at, at a certain point, we realized we needed uh, to add to that product line, and we came out with the Street Stick. And so between the Street Stick and the Quick Stick, uh, those two products were making up about 30% of our entire market. And for about two, two and a half years, we've probably been the leader, not probably, we have been the leader in that T12 replacement market. We came in at a, a good price uh, with a good product, with a, with a five-year product, five-year labor warranty. Um, but we realized that at a certain point, some of our competitors would be catching up with us. And there are those out there now that have come out with their own versions of stick products. Um, there are some variations that look very similar to ours, others that look uh, just like a fluorescent lamp. Uh, but we want to introduce the tap out and take it to the next level um, price-wise. So the tap out looks, as you can see, extremely similar to the uh, street stick. Uh, it does use a different module uh, on there, and that module that we're using is not available as a module only. This particular module is going to be used strictly for the, the tap out. Now, one of the features that you're going to see there uh, for the tap out that is going to be standard uh, is the six foot wire whips. So you can see that in the picture. Now these will be available in single sided and double sided versions. So let's go to the next uh, slide guys. I'm going to take a poll here. Um, this poll is just to just make sure everybody's awake and listening to me. Uh, hopefully you all are. Um, whoops, here we go. Which tap out spec is, is false? We haven't covered this yet, but uh, um, let me go through this. Which tap out spec is false? Does it come with the Batwing optic lens? The answer is yes, it does come with an optic lens. The next question, is it IP65? No, that's the false one here. It is IP67, so that's important. Make sure you understand that this is IP67. Is it only available in True White 7000K? That is true. It is only available in 7000K. Uh, if you need the, the, a stick product in any other Kelvin rating, it's, we will go back and, and utilize the street stick, which comes in 35, 5,000, 7,000, and 9,000. So, and is it 95 lumens per watt? The answer is yes, that is true. So, um, we'll, we'll go past that poll, guys, and go to the next slide. This is why we have the tap out. This is probably the best reason for us coming out with the tap out. It will give your customers the best ROI on the market. Where you can reach a faster uh, break-even point uh, and show them a return on their investment in a in a faster amount of time than any other product on the market. Um, the the lower cost, uh, we are narrowing the the price gap between fluorescence and and T12 replacements with LEDs. 
um, with these new features that we have, uh, one of the, adding new features, we're actually lowering the price. The the price on the tap out in comparison to the street stick or the or the quick stick is going to be anywhere from 20 to 30 percent less expensive. So we are actually adding features but coming down in price. So uh, we we want you to take that tap out challenge and and compare your total cost using the tap out to any of our competitors' prices out there. You will see that we are the most competitive product on the market. Next slide, guys. Talk about ease of use. Now, before I go any further, guys, if, if any of you have any questions out there for me, you can type those in uh, under the chat on your screen, and uh, we will answer any of those questions for you. So this is interactive. Uh, anything that you have a question on, please let me know. Um, just like with all of our other stick products, the Quick Stick and the Street Stick or any of the other stick products that we have, uh, we, the commonality between all of them is the extrusion. And the extrusion does still fit into existing sockets for retrofits, or you can use the existing mounting bracket that we have, that we've always had uh, for new construction. It all still works. One of the biggest benefits here, though, is that six-foot whips. In the past, we could add longer lengths of whips onto uh, our products for you, but there was always an extra charge. Now, even though we're lowering the price for the tap out compared to the street stick and quick stick, it will come with the six foot whips at no extra charge. So we can go to the next slide. It does come with the Batwing optic. Uh, that's important. So um, in, in utilizing the tap out, you would utilize it in the same place you would normally utilize the uh, street stick. This is going to be good for cabinets that are, say, between uh, up to 30 inches wide uh, and double-sided. Um, it's going to be available in all the standard sizes, just like the street stick and the quick stick has always been available in 18 inch and all the way up to 120 inch standard lengths and these are the exact same nominal lengths as a T12 lamp to fit uh, directly into the same spot as a T12 lamp would fit. Next slide please. Where would you use the tap outs? What are our recommendations? When, when you send in layouts to us, uh, here's what we're going to look at. For single-sided cabinets, this product in a, in a single-sided application would be good for cabinets that are between 6 inches and 15 inches in depth. Double-sided cabinets, anywhere from 12 inches to 30 inches in depth. And, and when I say that, guys, that's from face to face. If you've got pan faces, uh, then, then that's included. We, we, need, we need that distance uh, from the inside of one face to the inside of the opposite face. It is perfect for fluorescent retrofits on 12-inch centers. Everything that we have is based on 12-inch centers here. Specifications. Uh, we're going to take just an 8-foot uh, double-sided example for the specifications. Uh, you're looking at 4,500 lumens per stick, guys. That's extremely bright. This is the same brightness level as our uh, Street Stick HD, our high output version but at a much lower cost. It is 95 lumens per watt, and that's in the 7000K. There are 36 modules on a, on a stick, uh, 18 on one side, 18 on the other for a double-sided stick, and it is IP67. You're looking at 47.52 watts for that full 8-foot stick, and it does come with our 5 and 5 warranty, 5 years labor, 5 year parts. You're looking at 560 lumens per foot on this product, guys. This is extremely bright. So uh, on the next page, you'll see some more specifications. It is UL and CUL. It is in the SAM manual already. Uh, you can see the temperatures at, at which we recommend the operating temperature. And again, the far right bottom panel available in 7000K only. I, I just want to stress that again. Um, it is only available in 7000K. Any other color temperatures, we would go back to using the street stick. Now, 
this is not replacing the street stick. This is in addition to the street stick. The quick stick and the street sticks are still going to be available to you just like they always have. This is just an additional product to utilize in that lower price margin, uh, lower price to a product. So next slide, please. It looks like we're going to take another poll here, guys. Um, oops, here we go. What is the principal LED warranty for the tap out? Now, I'm going to have you guys type that into the chat. I want you guys to answer that for me. Um, we've covered that already. And so, if you would please um, type that in just so I'm, I know that somebody's listening out there and not taking a nap. Let's see how many responses we actually get. Daryl, I'm not. There's the questions area, and so you know the first one who responded correctly was Thomas On Onskin. How do you spell his last name? O N Y S K I N. So he'll, he would be our winner. Okay, guys. Um, I guess the poll's over. Um, just so you know, uh, Tom, and I hope I pronounced your last name correctly, Tom Oinskin, uh, was the first one with the correct answer. And uh, Tom, for being responsive and for answering that, uh, we have a $25 uh, gift card we're going to be sending to you. And uh, see you guys. Maybe the next poll you guys will listen to me and get in there. But Tom, uh, if you will hang on afterwards, we'll get your information, and we would like to send you a $25 gift card. Guys, uh, resources. If you go to our website, www.p-led.com backslash tapout.php, that will have all the information that we cover today. It will have our data sheets, our technical data sheets, but it will also have a flyer for those of you uh, maybe that are listening that are distributors of ours. Uh, thank you, by the way, to all, all of you for attending. Uh, you can print that flyer out and use that to uh, to go out and sell the product. So uh, just like all of our other products that are on our websites, the tap out is now there, and you'll be able to access all of the information on our website. Why tap out? Um, tap out would be used, again, when price is the primary factor. We are just simply closing the gap between LEDs and fluorescents in, in the retrofit and new construction market. It comes with the same warranty. It has the 7000K standard color. Uh, it is in stock now at Principal LED. Your distributors can order um, whenever you, you are ready. Um, but I want to stress that it is only the 7000K. But we're looking at a product, like I said, that is between 20 and 40 percent less expensive than our street stick, which was already less expensive than most of our competitors. Just to give you some general numbers, and again, I'm being very generic here, guys. I'm not quoting, so please let me, you know, just throw these numbers out there. Uh, if you were somewhere in the 10.50 to 11 dollar per foot range for our quick sticks or, or our street sticks. Uh, we're looking at a product with a tap out that's going to be somewhere um, south of, of, uh, of $750 to $7 a foot for a double-sided product. So that's just to give you a comparison. That is not a quote, so please don't take it as such. Um, guys, we are here. Uh, we're here to help. Please utilize our layout services. We have six gentlemen and, and they're waiting to, uh, to do layouts for you uh, at layouts at p-led.com. And those of you that have utilized us uh, know how fast we are in getting these back. But if you want the tap out, when you send a layout to us, please request the tap out. If you don't, uh, we're probably still going to lay it out with either quick stick or street stick, depending on what might be uh, uh, the best product. But if you want the tap out, if that's the direction you want to go, Please let us know up front, okay? Uh, another poll, okay. What's your question this time, guys? True or false? 
tap out is economy driven. Again, uh, looking for uh, you guys to uh, uh, type in your answer there, true or false. I think we might have another $25 gift card going out to the first person that responds also. All right. We've got a winner, but everyone can keep completing the poll. Um, the winner is Michelle Geyer. Sorry if I'm butchering these names, guys. <laughs> but way to go, Michelle. We'll, we'll get that in the mail for you. Thank you very much. Um, guys, we have distributors coast to coast. Um, and here's a, a website, our website uh, on, on where to buy our products, not just the tap out, but everything else. So uh, this is on our website. You can go to the map and it'll pull up every distributor that we have for each uh, state that uh, is, is in, the, in the U.S., including Alaska and Hawaii. So um, next slide. Questions. Guys, here's your opportunity to ask me anything that you want. Uh, type it in if you don't mind, and uh, then Jessica and uh, Matthew will relay those questions to me, and we'll get them answered for you. All right, Daryl, we've already got a couple that have come in. Uh, one question from Ian, is it available now? Uh, is, the question is, is the tap out available now? The answer is yes, absolutely. It is available now in every size, um, 18 inches all the way up to 120 inches, single or double-sided. Six-foot uh, wire whips will be uh, coming automatically on those. Um, and so that your, your local distributor may or may not have them on the shelf, but we do have them at Principal LED in San Angelo, Texas, and can ship them out immediately. So I hope that answers your question there. Next question. All right, Daryl, this one's from Charlie. He's asking, do you need to split the load, or can you run it continuous? Um, good question. This is not constant current, so yes, you do need to split the load, just like you have with the, uh, the street stick and the, uh, and the quick stick. So the wiring will be the same. Uh, no change there. Next All right, we've got some really good questions. Uh -huh. Yep, we've got a few more that are coming in. Uh, here's one for new builds. Are they the same mounting brackets as the quick stick? Is it the same mounting bracket for new build? The answer is yes. Uh, the, the commonality between all of our stick products is the extrusion, and the extrusion will fit either into a, an existing socket if it's a retrofit situation, or use the mounting brackets that you've always used with us that we provide. Uh, so that hasn't changed either. So, hope that answers your question. Uh, next question. Um, are custom links available on these? Are custom links available in the tap out? Uh, yes. Uh, at Principal LED, we pride ourselves in being versatile and doing value added uh, uh, things with our products to help our customers out. So, if you need a custom link, we absolutely can do that. The longest that we can do, though, is 120 inches uh, because our extrusion only comes up to 10 feet. Anything past that uh, is very difficult and, and would have to have some sort of connection, and you start getting some, some uh, sagging if it's in a horizontal um, installation. But yes, there are custom links available. Uh, are there any plans for different color temps in the future? No. Uh, are there plans for uh, different color temps? The answer is no. Uh, we're trying to make this as economical as possible, so we're sticking with the one color temp so that we can um, uh, keep the cost down. And uh, I'm not saying that it won't happen. I'm just saying that uh, as of right now, there are no plans to have other color temps on the tap out other than 7,000. Here's one that I can answer. It's that someone's asking, Stephen's asking, when will the new catalogs be coming out with all of the new products? <laughs> and <laughs> so just so everyone knows, we try to have a new catalog every, twice a year. So we just finished up our fall version, which has been distributed, and we'll have a spring version. So we actually are a few months out, but those data sheets will be available on the website in the meantime. So Daryl, another question for you. Um, is there 
Oh, I'm sorry. How does the light level and uniformity compare to the quick stick from Dustin? From the quick stick? Um, the quick stick that we've had on the market for quite some time has been 6,500K. Uh, this is going to be 7,000K, so there's a little bit of difference in the color. But it is the same color and is exactly the same color temperature and light output as the, uh, as the um, street stick, uh, HD. The 7000K and the chip used in this new tap-out version matches exactly all of our modules for the, the uh, uh, Street Fighter family. So you could intermix uh, the, the uh, Street Stick, the tap-out, and any of our other Street Fighter modules all in the same program. Uh, hope that answers your question there. Thanks, Cheryl. Uh, here's another question. Thomas is asking if you can put the color lenses on it like the Fusion Freedom. Uh, can you put the color lenses on it like the Fusion Freedom? The answer is no. Um, this is not a removable um, lens on this particular module, although we can take the Fusion Freedom module and put it on a stick. Uh, we're, we're sort of like the State Fair. We can put anything on a stick that you want us to. Uh, so we can take the Fusion Freedom module and put it on a stick where you could change out the lenses that way. That's a completely different product. Uh, we don't have any specifications on it yet, but because of our versatility and the fact that we do assemble in San Angelo, we do have that capability. Uh, if that comes up, uh, just let us know and we'll be glad to, uh, to uh, uh, price you on that also. Here's one from Jim. How many feet per power supply? How many feet per power supply? Uh, let me look real quick. I have my handy dandy uh, spec sheet on here. And I'll just add two guys. There should be an area on your webinar screen called handout. And if you open that up, you should have the tap out flyer and the tap out stick data sheet that you can download right now. So that'll have all of those details that I'm sure Daryl's looking at it, that specific one up for you right now. Yeah. Um, I'm looking at it, guys, and it has the same specifications as far as uh, wattage as the Street Stick HD. And so it would be the same number of feet at basically 20 feet on a 60 watt power supply. Um, let's see, on a 96 inch uh, double sided, you actually are at 47.52 watts. So, um, so I hope, again, I hope that helps. You can run two, you can run just one ninety six inch, so it's the same footage basically. Next question. Great. We're actually starting to narrow them down. There's only a couple left. Um, so if anyone has one, just try to get those in right away. We're gonna wrap up by one thirty. Is there an upcharge for custom sizes and widths? Is one question. Um, is there a, a no, the answer is no on the custom sizes. Uh, what we do is we round up to the next size. So if, if a standard size is a 96 inch and you wanted something that was 94 inches or 93 inches, uh, your, your price would be the same as a 96 inch is, is the way we do it. Uh, as far as custom whips, it's going to come standard with six foot whips. If you needed something shorter than that, uh, there would be no upcharge obviously because we're just cutting off. Uh, but if you needed something longer than that, then there would probably be an upcharge and we'd have to get with your distributor and find out how many of those you want, but it'll be a minimal charge. Next question. All right. Um, what is the lumen comparison for an 8-foot T12HO? Well, that's very difficult to say because if you're looking at an 8-foot um, tap-out, uh, you're looking at 4,500 lumens per stick. But unlike a fluorescent uh, who has uh, lumens going 360 degrees with not all of that getting to the face, 
the question should be, and, and the appropriate question should be, what is the, the, the lumen output at the face with the T12 versus the lumen output at the face compared to the tap out? And that answer is basically they're virtually the same. Uh, if you were to put a, a T12 lamp in a sign and put the tap out in a sign and took light readings at the face, they would be almost identical. But that's the best way to, to measure that light and, and is the visual side of it at the face. So I hope that answers your question. All right, Dale, I've one, got one, one more. I'm sorry? One more and then we'll move ahead. Okay, one more and then we'll move on. Yep, perfect. Um, What's the exact module we're using on the tap out stick and will it be available in bag form for custom shaped cabinets? Yeah. I think you the touched tap, on this already. Yeah, the, the tap out uh, is a brand new module for us, one that we developed specifically for this application and it will not be available in bag form only. Uh, it is only going to be used on, the, on a stick uh, for the new tap out stick. So at this point, it is not available uh, as a separate uh, module by itself. We still have plenty of other modules, guys, the, the, the Street Fighter series, our Fusion series. Uh, so we have plenty of other modules that will do the same thing. Uh, but we're, we're reserving the tap-out module just for this tap-out stick. So, Guys, thank you for all those good questions. Um, if you have more questions, please feel free to, to email them to us or to call me, um, and I'll be glad to answer them. Just quickly, I want to cover a couple of other things before um, we lose you guys out there. Our new Fusion Freedom, uh, we do have a couple of promotions going on. We are having a chopper custom built for us by a great organization, uh, that is, uh, and we are going to be giving that chopper away uh, at ISA in Las Vegas this year. Now this promotion is going to go on until March 31st. For every box of Fusion Freedom that you buy, and there's 100 feet in a box, for every box there will be an entry card, and that entry card can be filled out, sent in to us, and that will be what All right, hey guys, it sounds like we might have lost Daryl. Daryl, if you can, uh, if you uh, can am hear Am I still us. here? Oh, there you are. Okay, you're back. I'm sorry. I'm back. I'm sorry. Um, I, I hope I, everybody heard me on what was going on with the uh, with the customized chopper that we're giving away. It will be given away at yeah, ISA, and uh, we got that covered. Now, on the, on the power supplies, there are going to be two free 60-watt uh, drivers in every box of 100 feet. These are 120 uh, volt only input. They are not uh, uh, 277, 120 only. But for every box of 100, you will be receiving two free power supplies. And that is um, for a limited amount of time, and that's going to go on until the end of the year. Uh, everybody, thank you very much for your time and attention. Uh, any questions? Uh, I do think that uh, Jessica and uh, Matthew have one more thing for you. Uh, I'm going to sign out, but thank you again very much. And if you have any questions, please let me know. Thank you, Daryl. If anyone doesn't have Daryl's email, it is daryl at p-led.com. You guys should also have seen my email in some of these webinar invitations and confirmations. You're welcome to email me with questions. Uh, we're going to sign off, but if you can please hold on, keep your browser open for just a minute, and a survey should pop up. If you can just take a minute to complete that, we would really appreciate it. Thank you so much for everyone's time today, and we hope to see you at the next PLED Academy webinar. Thank, Thank you. you.